you have to get you. <laughs> but anyways, it's not funny. I was just like, I was telling you, anyways, I was like laughing the whole time. Oh, oh. my gosh, we're live. <clears throat> Good morning, and thank you for tuning in to Connection News. My name is Josiah Elias. And I'm Laura Suomo. In today's news, this week we will have our Discovery Series course membership 101. It will meet on Wednesday, January 7th at 7 p.m. in Building C. This class is taught by Pastor Bob Maddox. Thanks, Laura. Don't forget that tonight at 6 p.m. in the sanctuary, we're having a special emphasis on prayer. So our evening services are more or less continuing this evening, but don't forget, it's going to be prayer and worship oriented. It's going to be a lot of fun, so make sure you come out tonight at 6 p.m. And don't forget that continuing next Sunday night, we're going to get back into our, our usual routine, and we're going to have the small groups, the Sunday night small groups. We have guys-only groups, women's-only groups, young couples, uh, a youth group that all meets in these little tables around the service and we discuss the lesson that was just taught or anything that God has been teaching us over the last couple weeks. And uh, there's usually food there. We all have some snacks. We hang out. We talk. It's a lot of fun. So make sure you come out uh, tonight at 6 p.m. for the prayer and worship session. And then don't forget to keep coming out on, on Sunday nights at 6 p.m. for our normal Sunday night services. Laura? Thanks, Josiah. People You're sure welcome. love that food on Sunday nights. They sure do. And in other news, our Royal Rangers will be meeting in Building C at 6 p.m. beginning this Sunday night. Uh, this is a great program for boys. They do all kinds of camping skills. They learn about the Bible and they eat food also. Back to you, Josiah. Thanks, Laura. Sure do like food. Tastes really good. And speaking of food, at 9 a.m. Sunday mornings, we've got our coffee bar in the back of the church. Let me show you what we got going on there. Come up and get your cup of coffee, tea, hot chocolate, even some fruit or pastries. It's a great time to relax and just talk with others before the service about things that God has been showing you or how your life troubles are coming along. Just come and hang out with us at the coffee bar, 9 a.m. Sunday mornings. Mm, that sounds great, Josiah. 9 o'clock Sunday mornings. I think I'll be there. That's correct, and I like the color blue. So in other news today, we have Jill Montoya live in the field. Let's shoot over to her right now. Jill? Jill. Hey, Jill. Jill! Well, hello, Josiah. Yes, I am on location where our next story is going to take place. I'm here to tell you about Scrap Happy. Yes, it will be taking place in this very building behind me, the Building C Building, on Friday night, January 16th at 6.30. And if you like to hang out, talk, laugh, eat, and maybe even do a special project on Scrap Happy Night, I will show you an example. Laura Sfalmo sent me this very birthday card that she made at Scrap Happy. So as you know, folks, if you would like to come out and acquire such talent and skill, please come out Friday the 16th. And I understand the um, Scrap Happy is under a new management by Liz Salazar, so just let us know by putting your name in the communique. It's going to be a lot of fun. Back to you, Josiah. Oh, 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 oh that's okay. Oh, oh, that's okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, thank you for that, Jill. It was very good. And, uh, yes, yes. I'll be there. I'll be at the scrap happy. There. Thank you, Jill. Thank, thank you, Jill. Yes. And um, cell phones. Speaking of which, we need to make sure that we have our cell phones off during the service, as always. <laughs> I always do, of course. <laughs> what else would I be doing? You know? Really? Yeah. You really keep your cell phone off? All yeah. the time? Yeah! Like, all the time, for sure. Why? Well, you know, we do keep video records of these things. Are you sure you want to keep with that statement? You keep them off all the time? I don't have no, no videos of... <laughs> videos of the what? Do you have videos? We have videos. We have videos of our dear announcer who cannot keep his cell phone off during church. This is what could happen to no, you. Wait, don't play the video. No, don't play the video. No, silence. Uh, what? Oh my god. Oh my god, my god, my god. I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Pastor, when they ask me, say, uh, Pastor, when you do our funeral, there's some things. You're right. I remember. 
Just a little tough trying to get over the withdrawals, like Pastor Bob trying to get off a of coffee. It's just hard. But anyways, last on our agenda is the kids. You guys can go. Go ahead. Go and, and have fun like I used to be able to have. Have fun. Just go have fun. You, you can go. Seriously, you can go. You know what? I'm going to go, too. I'm taking this chair with me. Children, you're dismissed. Bye, everybody. This has been Connection News.